Hey you guys, welcome back to Catching Waves Yoga with me, Leslie. I hope you guys are doing well and well, welcome to my uh, art studio. I know it looks a little different from the last time that you guys are with me, but as you're aware, if you've been following along in the group, um, we had some flooding issues in our basement, which is a bummer. Um, so for the time being, we're gonna be up here in my art studio. So I hope you guys enjoy the setup. Um, I don't know if you are aware, some artists are actually super organized and I like to have my stuff on display. It just makes me feel a little more creative that way. So with that being said, we might be in a new place but it's still me. Same energy, same stuff that you're used to. So get yourselves ready. Go ahead and set up your watch if you really wanna do that. You know, I like to track my time. Um, and then let's do some dang yoga. Maybe take a sip of your water before we begin because I think I'm gonna bring some energy today. All right, get your mat set up. Come on down to the floor, sitting up nice and tall, arms in your lap, just nice and comfortable, legs crossed, and go ahead and close your eyes. Take a big inhale in through the nose, and out through the mouth. Inhaling in, exhale, let it go. One more just like that, in, out. Great, just let that breath come in and out of your nose. Make sure you're sitting up nice and tall. Don't start to round forward here. Pull your chin back in space just slightly. And just bring your entire awareness to that breath. Notice how it feels as it enters into your body. Notice the smells that you might smell around you. I have my diffuser going today with bergamot and cedar wood and it is just energizing and relaxing at the same time. So you get this nice citrus scent every time I breathe in. With your next exhale, just release your shoulders down away from your ears. Maybe even turn your palms up on your legs just to invite in a little extra energy. And bring together your index finger and your thumb or any other finger that feels comfortable to you. Just feel the weight of your body getting a little heavier into your mat. And I want you to set a little mantra for our practice today. We'll start the mantra with I am, and you can fill in whether it's a word or a sentence that continues that. Something that is just meaningful and motivating to you and that you wish someone else would say it to you. So why don't you just say it to yourself? So do that now. Hold that mantra just in your head and come back to that throughout the practice, whether it's I am strong, I am beautiful, I am energized, I am calm, I am protected. Whatever version it is for you, it's clearly something that you need to hear. So the more we can say that to ourselves, we, we know that we can truly heal our own self from within and you're not giving that power away to anyone else. Right? You have more control over your entire life than you think you would do. So I'm here to help guide you and to help give you those baby steps on how you can take control of your life again. And we start by just breathing. With your next inhale, I want you to really feel your entire front body. Feel that oxygen go into the deepest part of your lungs. 
Inhale, sitting up even taller, filling that chest, filling that belly. Exhale, let it go. And bring your left hand to your heart, right hand to your belly. And again, just focus on filling up your entire front body. Inhaling in. Exhale, let it go. One more, just like that. In. Out. Great. Bring your hands right onto your ribs. And this time as you inhale, feel your ribs press into the outer walls. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Engage your abs. Force that air out. One more just like that. In. And out. Awesome. Bring that left hand up to your collarbone and your right hand just below your belly button. This time as you breathe, really feel that air extending through your entire upper body. You might even start to get a slight arch back as you inhale in. Inhale. Exhale. Pretend you're an accordion. Do -do -do. <laughs> inhale. Exhale. Great job. You can release your hands back down to your legs. Open your eyes. Bring a giant smile onto your lips if you're not already. Inhale in. Exhale. Release your hands down to your hips. Sitting up nice and tall. Loop those shoulders back and down your spine. Inhale. Lift your arms all the way up. Thumbs pointing to the wall behind you. Look to the ceiling. Big stretch here. Exhale. Float your hands down. Inhale, lifting. Exhale, lower. Inhale. Exhale. One more. In and out. Great. Go ahead and bring your hands onto your knees again. Tuck your fingers underneath of your knees right here. And as we inhale, we're going to press our chest forward. Pull those shoulder blades back into the center of your spine. Look up. Exhale, tuck that chin into your chest. Pull your back towards the wall behind you. Inhale, lengthen, come forward. Exhale, round. Inhale. Exhale. Keep it going. Two more. Last one. Great job. Inhale, sitting up nice and tall. One big breath. Exhale, let it go. Come on to all fours. Bring your knees right underneath of your hips, your wrists directly under your shoulders here. Go ahead and curl your toes under. Get a nice flat back. Send your gaze out just past your nose here. Inhaling in, pressing into your hands, lifting away from that mat. And exhale. Inhale, drop your belly, send your gaze forward, lift your hips towards the ceiling. Exhale, round, pull your chest towards the sky, tuck your chin in, curl your tailbone under. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, round. Moving through our cat cows. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Great. Come on back to our neutral tabletop position. Uncurl your toes. Just press the tops of your feet into your mat. Inhale. Send your hips over to the right side. Just a little shift in your hips here. And look over your left shoulder. Release through your jaw so you can get a nice deep stretch in through the right side of your neck. You'll feel it even into your shoulder. And just breathe. One more breath here. Big inhale. Exhale, come back to center, send your hips to the left side, look over your right shoulder this time. Part your lips just slightly, releasing through your jaw, inhaling in, out. Make sure you're letting your shoulders drop away from your ears. And that next inhale, come back to center, go ahead and curl your toes under. Press into all 10 fingers and send your hips all the way up to the sky. Downward dog. 
I want you to roll your elbow creases towards that front wall. Think turning your biceps towards the ceiling. Press into all 10 fingers here. It's okay if you have a bend in your knees or even if your heels are lifted. I'd rather you have your hands in the proper position so with time, you can eventually get to straight leg and a nice straight torso. Inhaling in and out. One more breath here. In, out. Go ahead and inhale. Bend your knees. Look forward and walk yourself all the way to the front of your mat. Bringing your feet close together. Inhaling in. Release your upper body over your lower body. Get a nice big bend in your legs here. Tuck your chin into your chest. And just breathe. It's okay if your arms don't come all the way to the floor. With time, you'll gain that flexibility. Inhale, glide your hands all the way up to your thighs, straighten through your legs, straighten through your upper body so you're creating the figure seven. Inhaling in, exhale, forward fold, release that upper body down. Tuck your chin into your chest. Nice big bend in your knees here, opening up through that low back. Inhale, lengthen, glide your hands to your shins this time. Exhale, fold. Inhale, we're going to glide all the way up to standing, slow and controlled, rolling all the way there, straighten through your legs, tuck your tailbone under, roll through that low back, mid back, upper back, loop your shoulders up, back and down, lengthen through your neck, lengthen through your head. Open your palms to the wall in front. Go ahead and close your eyes. Inhaling in and out. Release your shoulders down. Big inhale. Exhale. Inhale, lift all 10 toes off the mat. Try not to open your eyes and peek, you cheaters. You're going to feel your body shift. It's gonna catch itself. Take a big inhale in, exhale, release your toes all the way down, open your eyes, inhale, bend your knees, drop your hands down, draw a big circle up and overhead as you stand back up, give me a slight back bend at the top, and exhale, forward fold, inhale, lengthen, exhale, fold, go ahead and plant your palms down on the mat. Step one foot back and then the other, coming into plank. Make sure your wrists are right under your shoulders. You can always drop down onto your knees if you need that modification. Inhaling in, pull that belly button into your spine. Press away from your mat here. Big breath. And with your exhale, we're gonna slow and control the lower all the way down, keeping your elbows into your side. Belly all the way down, uncurl your toes. Inhale, press into your hands, lift your upper body away from the floor. Loop those shoulder blades back and down your spine, flex through your glutes so we can stabilize that low back. Inhaling in, and as you exhale, send your hips towards your heels. You can open your knees as wide as your mat, bring your big toes into touch. We're gonna bring our forehead all the way down to the mat. Child's pose. Take a big inhale in through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Inhale. Exhale. One more, just like that. In. Out. Great. Just let that breath come in and out through the nose. As so you allow your heart rate to stabilize, your breath to come to a nice normal rhythm here. Inhaling in. And out. I want you to bring a smile onto your lips. And think of one thing that you're grateful for from today.
And with your next inhale, find your flow up to your tabletop position. Go ahead and fix all your clothes because I'm sure they've somehow moved everywhere. <laughs> and when you're ready, curl your toes under, send your hips to the sky, downward dog. Inhaling in, turning your biceps towards the ceiling. Exhale. Inhale, look forward, bend your knees, step or walk all the way to the front. Inhale, lengthen, halfway left. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle, all the way out. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle. Exhale, hands to your heart. Take a breath there. Fix your hair. Fix your clothes. Because, you know, it's what we do as ladies. Men, maybe you have the same issue. I don't really know. Take one more big inhale in. And as you exhale, step to the center of your mat. Open your feet nice and wide, as wide as you are comfortable. Just point your toes towards that front wall. Inhaling in and out. Inhale, sweep your arms all the way up towards the ceiling. Big stretch here. And as we exhale, slow and controlled, send your hips to the wall behind you, coming into our halfway lift, holding it there for just one breath. You can get a slight bend in your knees here. Inhale, exhale, forward fold all the way down. Nice wide standing stance. Inhale, press your fingers into the floor, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen, holding it here. I want you to bring your fingertips right underneath of your nose. You can choose your left hand or your right hand, it doesn't matter. And when you inhale, open that opposite hand to the ceiling, look up. You can again have a nice bend in your knees here. Find what's comfortable for you here. If it's not comfortable to look up, look straight out towards the side or look towards the floor. We're all at our different levels when it comes to our abilities, where we are in our journey, whether you are in pain or you're not in pain, maybe you've had a surgery, maybe you haven't, right? We're all at different stages. Take one more big inhale in. Exhale, release that hand down. We're gonna lift that opposite one up. Focus on that breath. Big inhale and exhale. Two more breaths here. Really fill your lungs up. Feel your rib cage pushing to that side wall. And exhale, release that arm down, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift, holding it there. We're gonna send all of our weight into that right leg, getting a nice generous bend, nice lengthening through that left side, feeling that inner thigh getting a nice stretch. Inhale, coming up to center. Exhale, sending it to the opposite side. Inhale, keep it shifting. Inhaling up, exhale over. Inhale, exhale. Use your hands to help guide you all the way through. Use your breath. Keep your feet planted on the floor. Don't come up onto that heel. Don't lift in the side of the foot. One more, each side. And coming back to center, forward fold. Bring your hands right onto your hips, bend your knees, slow and controlled. Roll all the way up to standing. Inhaling in and out. Bring a big smile onto your lips, you guys. You've earned it. And as you exhale, turn your feet to the right side of your mat. Come up onto the ball of that back foot. Inhaling in. Getting your chest nice and tall here. And as we exhale, go ahead and get a bend in that front leg. You might have to step that back leg in just a smidge. Find what's comfortable for you. And as you inhale, lift your arms all the way up. Up and overhead. If it's not comfortable to have your arms here, bring them to your hips. Roll your shoulders towards the back wall. Focus on your breath. Pull that core in. Tuck your tailbone under. Guys, I'm bossy, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Take a big inhale in and out. 
One more breath here. See if you can arch just slightly in that upper body. And with your next exhale, one fluid motion. Open your arms to the side while plant that left heel down behind you, angling your toes towards the center of your mat. Notice if you lift it in that front leg, send it back down. Pull your pinkies to the back wall. Look over your front hand. Inhaling in and out. Inhale. Exhale. See if you can sink a little lower in your hips here. One more breath here. In. And as you exhale, release that back arm down your back thigh. Send your front arm up to the sky. Look up. Look to the side. Look down. Find what's comfortable for you. Notice if you lift it out of that front knee. Give it a little bend. Inhaling in. Really extend through your fingers here. One more big breath in and out. With your next inhale, we're gonna cartwheel our hands all the way to the front of the mat. Plant those palms, step your right foot back and move through your vinyasa. Inhaling into plank. Exhale, slowly lower. Inhale, lifting into up dog. And exhale, send it back into child's pose. You've earned it. Keep your arms extended out in front. Close your eyes. Take a big inhale in through the nose. And exhale through the mouth. Inhaling in. Exhale, let it go. One more just like that. In. Out. Great. Just let your breath come in and out through your nose. Dig your fingertips into your mat, press down, feel your hips shifting towards your heels a little bit more. You can lift your forearms off the ground, getting an extra stretch in your torso, maybe even rocking your torso left and right. Find what's comfortable for you. You can always stay here just in stillness. Wherever you're at, whatever you're doing, I want you to bring a smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a second thing that you're grateful for from today. With your next inhale, find your flow all the way up to downward facing dog. Focusing on your breath here, seeing if you can release your heels a little closer to the mat this time, now that you've warmed up and stretched a little bit. Inhaling in and out. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward, step or walk all the way to the front of your mat. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, slow and controlled, roll all the way up to standing. Loop those shoulders up, back and down. Open your palms to the wall in front. Take a breath here. Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up. Give me a slight back bend. Exhale, bring your hands to your heart. Open to the center of your mat and spread your legs nice and wide, pointing your toes to the wall in front. Fix all your stuff. Do a little dance. <laughs> Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up, standing up nice and tall, big stretch. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Bring your hands onto your hips, and as you're ready, slow and control, bend those knees, and rise all the way up to standing. This time we're gonna turn our feet to the left side of the mat. 
coming onto the ball of that back foot. Little trick here is you can bend your knee, tuck that tailbone under, and then lengthen. So that way you know you've got the proper positioning and you're gonna get the most adequate stretch here. Inhale, lift your arms up and overhead, get a nice big bend in that front knee, making sure your knee is directly over your ankle. Inhaling in and out. Inhale, lengthen through that upper body. See if you can give yourself a slight back bend here. Nothing that's gonna cause pain. Always just testing the boundary, seeing if we can go just a smidge further. One more big inhale, exhale, fluid motion, plant that heel, open your arms as wide as the room. Still keep that deep bend in your front leg. Inhaling in, looking over your front fingers here, pull those pinkies towards the back wall. Pretend like you're trying to hold a pencil between your shoulder blades. Inhaling in, and out. Release your shoulders down away from your ears here. Focus on that breath. Feel the energy coming into your legs. Maybe it's starting to burn or shake. It's okay. Inhaling in. And out. Inhale. Exhale. Release that back arm down your back thigh. Send your front arm up to the sky. Notice if you lift it in that front leg, sink it down. Focus on your breath. Really press your feet into the ground here. Big inhale. Big exhale. Really, again, feel your ribs expanding to that side wall. Use your diaphragm. It connects to over 100 joints, you guys. It's insane. One more big breath in. And as we exhale, we're going to cartwheel our hands all the way down. Plant those palms. Step your left foot back. When you're ready, move through your vinyasa. And exhale, send it back into child's pose. You can keep your arms extended out in front of your head, or you can pull them in right underneath of your shoulders here. Find what's comfortable for you. Close your eyes if you haven't already. Focus on that breath, big inhale in. Big exhale out. Keeping the inhale and the exhale of an even pace, even length. Bring a smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a third thing that you're grateful for from today, but this time be a little more specific. With your next inhale, find your flow all the way up to downward facing dog. Focusing on your breath, spiraling your biceps towards the ceiling. Press into the index finger knuckles. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward, step or walk all the way to the front of the mat. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Bring your hands to the backs of your ankles. Pull your elbows to the side walls. See if you can get a little deeper fold here. Tuck your chin into your chest. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle all the way up. Exhale, hands to your heart. Go ahead and open to the front again. Spreading your legs nice and wide. Inhale, sweep your arms all the way up. Big stretch. Exhale, forward fold. 
Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Holding it here at the top, I want you to turn your toes just slightly towards the outer walls here. And when you're ready, we're going to get a nice bend in our legs, bring our palms together, send your elbows into your knees, slow and controlled, start to sink your hips down. You can inch your feet in a little closer if that's more comfortable to you. If it's too much to get your hips way low, keep them lifted here, but make sure your chest is also lifted. Focus on your breath, inhaling in and out. Really lift your chest here, press into those elbows, into your knees, helping you find that balance. Inhaling in, exhale, let it go. Feel your lower diaphragm opening up here. Focus on that breath. Find something out in front of you to hold your gaze. You can stay right here, or if you'd like, you can try to lift one leg and then the other. And when I say leg, I really mean your heel because lifting a leg would be really difficult. <laughs> and if you'd like an extra challenge, you can try to lift both heels at the same time, coming up onto your toes, holding it there for one breath. Inhale, exhale, slow and control, lower all the way down. I'm surprised I got that one, I usually almost fall. <laughs> you can find a slight sway side to side, just feeling your hips opening here. Won't be here for very long, inhale in. Exhale, one more big breath in. Inhale, exhale, bring your palms down, send your hips to the sky, point your toes towards the front of the wall, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen, holding it there. And as you exhale, we're gonna walk ourselves to the right side of your mat, plant those palms, step your right foot back, move through your vinyasa. And sending it back into child's pose. Release your forehead all the way down. Take a big inhale in. Exhale, let it go. Inhale. Exhale. One more breath here. In. Out. Glide your hands back under your shoulders and with your next inhale, press yourself away from your mat, pull your knees into center. Send your weight back into your heels here. Sitting up nice and tall in your chest, you can have your hands on your thighs or right down at your side, palms open to the wall in front. Inhaling in and out. Take your right hand to your chin, press it back towards that back wall aligning your ear right over your shoulder. Inhaling in and out. One more breath here, in, out. Inhale, shift your weight forward, curl your toes under. Slow and controlled, send your weight back into your heels, getting a nice stretch through the bottoms of your feet. Inhaling in and out. Again, gliding your chin towards that back wall. Focus on your breath here. Feel that nice deep stretch through your feet. If it's a little too intense, you can always lift out of your hips, relieving some of that pressure here. Inhale. Exhale. Notice where you're holding in tension. Maybe your shoulders are coming up to your ears again. Release them down. And just focus on your breath. Inhale, sweep your arms all the way up. Exhale, release them down. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale. Exhale, palms to your chest here. Take a breath. Great, inhale, shift forward, send your legs to one side, bringing your bottom all the way down to the floor. And extend your legs out in front, 
Flex your toes in towards your nose. Bring your hands right at your hips, palms on the mat. Inhale, lengthen through that torso. See if you can get even taller here. Pretend like someone's pulling a string through the center of your head, connected to your spine, helping you move. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up. Exhale, fold over your legs. Catch where you can. If it's just your shins, awesome. If you can get to your ankles, even better. Someday, you'll be able to get to the bottoms of your feet. No stretching, I mean, no straining here, no stressing about it. Just do what your body can do. And when you're ready, tuck your chin into your chest. Focus on that breath. Inhale. Exhale, feel your body shifting a little forward here, sinking a little deeper. Inhaling in and out. Two more breaths here. Inhale, slow and controlled. Roll that upper body all the way back up, nice and tall. And exhale, go ahead and plant your feet down onto the mat. Again, sitting up nice and tall. You can grab right underneath of your kneecaps here. Help yourself lengthen. And when you're ready, open your palms to the wall in front. Palms open to the ceiling. Inhaling in. Exhale, sinking it back just until you can feel your core engaged. Pull your belly button in. I don't want you rounding in the spine. Inhale. Exhale. Holding it here, and if this is enough of a deep core engagement for you, stay here. Otherwise, try to lift one leg and then the other. Loop those shoulders back and down your spine. If you notice you start to round, pull your chest and your knees in towards one another. Inhaling in and out. Big breath in. Exhale, let it go. Inhale, see if you can walk those legs up towards the ceiling, lengthening in here. Really lengthen through your arms, lengthen through your legs, pull your belly button in. Exhale, everyone, release an inch. Inhale, lift it up. Exhale, release. Inhale, exhale. One more, all the way up. Exhale, slow and control. No belly flops, you guys. Send it all the way down. Release your arms up and overhead. Big stretch here. And as you exhale, pull your hands towards your hips and pull your knees into your chest. Catching with your hands, getting a little stretch here. Maybe you lift your tailbone off the mat or you find a rock side to side. Find what's comfortable for you. Inhaling in and out. And with your next breath, go ahead and plant your heels down walking your heels close to your hips. Inhale, exhale, plant your palms right next to your hips. And when you're ready, we're gonna go into our first bridge pose. Inhale, send your hips to the sky, pull your knees in towards the center. Really press those hips all the way up. Exhale, release. So you can walk your heels a little closer to your hips this time. Inhale, lifting, pressing even higher. And exhale, release. We'll do one more just like that. Inhale, holding it at the top for three breaths. Pull your knees in towards the center. Press your hips even higher. And just breathe. One more breath here. And as you exhale, slow and controlled. Release your hips down. Pull your knees into your chest. Give them a little tug. Inhale, holding it into center. And as you exhale, go ahead and release that left leg down. We're gonna bring our right palm down to the floor behind you. Exhale, send your right hip, right knee, over to the left side. I want you to keep that right shoulder down onto the mat. I'd rather have your shoulder down and your knee way up here versus you just try to do this and your arms coming up. Focus on your breath. And with that exhale, Look towards your right fingers. Feel yourself sinking into that twist with every exhale. And just allow your body to really slow down.
One more breath here. Big inhale. Big exhale. Come on back to center, pulling your knees into your chest, catching them with your hands. Give them a little tug. Inhale, holding it still in the center. Exhale, release that right leg down this time. Send your left palm to the floor. And when you're ready, send your left knee over to the right side. Look towards your left fingertips this time. Inhaling in. And out. Really focus on that breath here. Bring a smile onto your lips. Maybe even repeat that mantra that we started at the beginning of practice here. I am statement. One more breath here. Big inhale. Big exhale. Inhale, coming back to center, pulling both knees into your chest. Give them a little tug. Holding it in the center for one breath. Go ahead and rotate through your ankles. Get out your snap crackles and pops. <laughs> Maybe reverse directions. And when you're ready, go ahead and release one leg and then the other. Allow your feet to fall open as wide as the mat. Bring your palms down, open them up towards the ceiling. Find what's comfortable with your shoulders here. Take a big inhale in. And as you exhale, go ahead and close your eyes. As we move into our final resting pose, Savasana, we'll be here for several minutes, just focusing on our breath, being still, being present. Now, if your mind starts to wander, it's okay. Just bring your attention back to the breath as soon as you notice it. And the easiest way to do that is to start to count your breath. One on the inhale, two on the exhale, three, four. Keep that going until you get to 10 and then start again as we lay here in our stillness, being present, just breathing. your next inhale, go ahead and wiggle your toes, wiggle your fingers, and when you're ready, roll onto your side facing me, use your arm as a pillow, take a big inhale in, and now, inhale, press yourself away from the floor, come on up into a comfortable seated position, eyes closed, hands in your lap, sitting up nice and tall, take a big inhale in, and out. Bring your palms together all the way up to the forehead, inhaling in. And out. Be kind in your thoughts to yourself and others. Bring your hands down near your lips, inhaling in. 
and out. Be kind in your words to yourself and others. Just breathe. Bring your hands down to your heart center. Inhaling in and out. Be kind in your actions to yourself and others. Take one more big inhale in. And as you exhale, bow forward, sealing our practice. Namaste. Thank you guys so much for joining me this morning. It is always a pleasure, and I hope you guys enjoyed um, being in my art studio. We'll probably be here for the next little while until uh, we can fully get <laughs> the forced renovation uh, in our basement and get rid of all that flooding and redo the flooring. So anyways, I'm glad you guys were able to join. Um, those tank tops, there's only five days left to get one. Uh, I don't know when they will come back, so if you want one, snag it now. All of that money comes to help me redo my uh, yoga studio, help build this brand in general, and your support is truly everything. So thank you so much for joining me. If you're on YouTube, please go ahead and subscribe. I would love for you guys to join our community. And with that, I will see you guys again soon. Stay awesome, stay happy, stay healthy, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.